Published 12 hours AGO updated 39 minutes ago tracking the tropics. August 20, 2020 we are tracking two tropical depressions that are expected to strengthen in the coming days. One is expected to move west of Florida into the Gulf of Mexico while a second system in the Atlantic Ocean warrants our attention. Orlando, Florida two tropical depressions are moving west and strengthening, with the latest projection showing them impacting the United States coast. One of them is even expected to become a hurricane and impact Florida. Tropical Depression 13 formed on Wednesday night and is located hundreds of miles east of the northern Leeward Islands. The National Hurricane Center NHC, says that it is moving toward the west-northwest at 21 miles per hour. It should move near or north of the islands by late Friday. Then by Saturday, it is expected to be by the Virgin Islands and Puerto Rico. The NHC says that the depression currently has maximum sustained winds of 35 miles per hour. It is expected to strengthen into a tropical storm on Thursday. The latest projected path shows it eventually becoming a hurricane and impacting Florida. As of now, a tropical storm watch is in effect for Saba and St. Eustatius, St. Martin, Antigua, Barbuda, St. Kitts, Nevis, and Anguilla. Track the tropics. Visit the Fox 35 Orlando Hurricane Center for the latest in the tropics, including daily updates, live radar, and severe weather alerts. Then, Tropical Depression 14 formed in the Caribbean Sea on Thursday morning, the NHC confirmed. It is moving west near 18 miles per hour. It is expected to move near or just north of Honduras and the Bay Islands on Friday. Then, it will approach Mexico on Saturday. The NHC says the depression will strengthen into a tropical storm on Thursday. It could be at hurricane strength when it reaches Mexico. A tropical storm watch is currently in effect for the Honduras-Nicaragua border westward to Punta Castilla Honduras and the Bay Islands of Honduras. Stay prepared. Get all you need to know about the 2020 Atlantic hurricane season with the Fox 35 Orlando Hurricane Guide Fox 35 is advising residents of Central Florida to stay aware of these systems and monitor the latest forecasts and possible impacts here on the peninsula. The next names to be used for storms are Laura and Marco. Forecasters have predicted that the season will have more activity than normal. For example, National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration NOAA, predicted an above-average season, with 13 to 19 named storms. 6 to 10 of those would become hurricanes and 3 to 6 of those are forecasted to become major hurricanes category 3 or higher. In comparison, the 2019 Atlantic hurricane season had 18 named storms, matching 1969 for the fourth most lively season in the past 150 years. The 2020 Atlantic hurricane season runs until November 30th. Download the Fox 35 weather app to track the tropics on your phone, receive severe weather alerts, and get the latest daily forecasts. Watch Fox 35 news for the latest updates.